Okay, so here we go. Good morning to everybody. Today we are going to start uh, a new class, a new a new unit. Okay, uh, um, a new unit, the unit number two. So please pay attention and be on time. Thanks so much for being on time. Okay, I'm going to pass the list later. Okay, it's just that I need to tell you some 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 things. The first thing is that um, if you can check your edit platform right there, you have your guide, and I know that um, your teacher sent you the, the guide so you can start working. The thing is that I want to work with you, the book, okay, here on class, and I'm going to explain you the grammar and the vocabulary and working using our books. And the extra work, like for example, if you want, if you have to record uh, something, or you have to read a book, or or work on my English lab platform, you have to do it by yourself. But I know that you have a lot of things to do, so we are going to work using our books, okay? Here at the time that you have with me, okay? So if you have any any question, please raise your hand, okay? Or please tell me because in some case I am concentrator. Uh, I am concentrator, so I do not pay attention to to if you raise your hand or not. So if you have something to, to tell me, please write me in the chat, okay? Type a message or tell me something. So let's just start, okay? I'm going to, I don't know if you already work with the other teacher using the online book, but I'm going to use my online book, okay? So, we're going, this one is your top-notch book, okay? We are going to use your top-notch book, okay? It's, uh, this one is the page number, uh, wait. Wait, wait, wait. Not this page. Okay. Okay, yes, here we go. Can you see my presentation? And if you can, you please tell me. Yes. Yeah? Okay. Yes, teacher. So, week number one for the second unit, uh, grammar, we, we are going to start with the grammar. You are L1 from the second unit. Okay. This one is the agenda, the attendance, then the grammar, we are going to work. And if you have any questions, we are going to have the space to that you give me or you tell me all your questions, okay? Vocabulary, top match one, page number 38. So if you can go to your book, I have it here. If you don't have it, please, we are going to use our top match book. This one, okay. This one, page number 38, okay. Go to the page number 38 and we are going to start with it. Okay. And on your book page number 38, right here, if you don't have it, I have the, the book right here. So, Says food and restaurant. We are going to start. This one is pretty easy. The vocabulary because we are talking about food and restaurant. Okay, and we are going to make a review for the um, is and R, Okay, how to use is and R. There is and there are. That one is from elementary school, so it's a review. So it's going to be easy for you. So right here says appetizers. Right, it. Right here, we have a world coffee. Today's uh, special, this one is um, the menu from, from um, a cafeteria or a restaurant, okay? So we, go, we are going to, right here, we have some, um, uh, the appetizers, right? It's the first thing that you eat. We have potato soup, Colombian style, that is this one. And fries crisp with the spicy tomato sausage. That is this one. Then, wait. Then we have, sorry. Then we have the salad. 
Mix it green salad, that is this one, and tomato onion salad, that is this one. In trees, Brazilian steak, this one. Griller fish and roast chicken. Okay. Dessert, ice cream, apple pie, German chocolate cake. And before today, we have coffee, tea, soft drink, uh, fruit juice, and bottle of water. Okay. So let's watch the vocabulary. Okay, right here I have the vocabulary. Let me see, flash cards. Have to wait. Um, we are in unit number four. Class one. Okay, here we go. So I'm going to play it again okay? and please pay attention, okay? Appetizers. Salad. Entrees. Desserts. Beverages. Okay, it's the same one that we have right here. Okay. So right here, let's start working in our book. So says, read the menu, circle the words that are new for you. So I'm going to give you two minutes, okay? No, one minute, just to verify right here this part, okay? And you have to circle the words that are new for you, okay? Then we're going to circle and I'm going to tell you the meaning of each of the words, okay? So I'm going to give you one minute. Thank you, sorry, can you repeat? Yes, that you have to, for example, for me, I don't know what is the meaning of in trees, right? So I'm going to circle in trees, okay? I, so you have to circle the words that you don't know the meaning, okay? That you don't know what is, so you have to circle, okay? Okay. Okay, let me see. Carlos Kisivix, please tell me one word that you don't know or you know all the words. Desit, desserts. Desserts? This one? Yes. Okay. Desserts are the, 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 so for example, candies, ice cream, is the group of food that you can eat that is like candy or chocolate Postage. or uh -huh, candy, chocolate, okay? Things that you can eat that are sweet, sweet, okay? Like this one, this, this one, and this one are dessert, okay? Together. Let me see. Um, Marcos, Chutan, tell me a word that you don't know. Yes, teacher. You know all the meaning of the words. What? A word that you don't know, what is the meaning? Dried um, fish. Esther, this one, Driller. Yes. Okay. Griller fish are this one, look. Yes. Fish is the, the food, right? 
Angular is uh, the form that you prepare the griller piece. Okay. So this one is the griller piece. Thank you. And the last one. Let me see. Uh, Javier Farfan, please tell me a word that you do not understand or you don't you don't know the meaning. Okay, please tell me. You have to participate, okay? If you are not participating, the thing that's going to happen is that the next class or right now I'm going to tell you that you have to um, please um, use your camera because I want to see you, okay? If you do not participate, you do not going to have the attendance for today. It doesn't matter if you connect or not, okay? So you have to participate. Let's work on the second part. Okay, let's go to this part that says vocabulary. Okay. Vocabulary, part of a meal. Listen and repeat. Just listen, okay? So, please listen. Listen and repeat in the process. Appetizers, salad, entrees, desserts, beverages, okay, let's work on the part number D, this part, the part that we have right there, you have to write. Okay, so let me see. Says, no pain, write the name of at least one dish from your country for each category. And we have appetizer, salad, entry, dessert, and viewers from here, from Guatemala. So we have to write one appetizer, one salad, one entry and dessert and big rivers that is the thing that we drink okay so i'm going to give you again one minute okay so you have to write an appetizer a salad and an entry dessert and yes carlos in a very basket, I can put Coca Cola. Yes, it's something that we can eat, uh, we can drink, we drink here. You can write Coke or soda, or maybe you can uh, add something like hot chocolate, okay, or ponche or things like that, okay. So you can write anything that you know that in a restaurant you can find it here in Guatemala, okay. I'm going to give you one minute. Okay, let me see. Appetizer. Um, Salvatierra, can you please tell me an appetizer that you know? Uh, what did you? What? Uh, ¿sí se me escucha? I cannot listen, so can you please tell me using the chat your answer? Remember that this one are the appetizer. Look. Right? So let me see. I'm going to write an appetizer. For example, I know that one kind of appetizer can be 
sorry for my letter. I know that you have a better letter than me. It's the first time that I am using this this kind of chair. Yes. A wings buffalo. Ah yes, wings buffalo. Buffalo wings is correct. Okay. It's your idea, so you can write anything that you want. In my case, I'm going to write. Nachos, right? In English, nachos do not have translate to, to English, so it's nachos. Nachos with cheese or with beans or with uh, with meat, okay? Okay. Salad. Any of you, can you please tell me a salad that we can find here in a restaurant, a kind of salad? Go green. Oh, go green, yes. Oh, green salad, right? Excellent. Flesh fruits. Fruit salad, right, excellent. So we, I'm going to write green salad or fruit. Sorry for my letter, okay? Fruit. Teacher. Yeah. Eh, yo quería poner en dessert, eh, quería poner un caldo de gallina, pero no sé si se puede. Dessert, no, because desserts are sweet. This, the meaning of dessert yes. is postre. Austria. Ah, no, perdón, en Antri. Oh, en Antri, yes. Ah, uh, you tell me chicken soup, right? So, chicken. Thank you. Chicken. Sorry, chicken. Okay. I'm going to practice, okay? I promise. Okay, chicken soup. A dessert. Strawberry cake. Strawberry okay. and cheesecake and cheese pie. Cheese pie, cheesecake, strawberry um, cake, or strawberry pie, ice cream, right? Uh, strawberry cool. cake. What? Strawberry cake. Strawberry cake, okay. Anything that is cake. Cheesecake. Hot, ch hot uh, yeah, chocolate cake. Hot chocolate, uh -huh. Okay, yes. All of that is um, are fine, okay? Be very right. What we can write right here? Milkshake. Huh? Milkshake. Milkshake, excellent. What else? Someone of you tell me Coca-Cola. Champagne. What? Champagne? Yeah. Frappe. Yes. Okay. Yeah. How do you say horchata in English? Not has translator, so it's horchata, or in some case you can tell like um, uh, milkshake is a kind of milkshake. Do not have translator. It's the same of nacho. That is from one one a specific country. So in United States or in English, do not have translate, right? So horchata or horchata in any of the of the countries, okay? So, but you can write it right there. Okay? So I know that you know the meaning and the vocabulary. I know that you identify what it what are appetizers, salad, and cheese desserts. And the drinks. So let's continue working, okay? On the next one. That's photo story. That's photo story. And the uh, and here says, read and listen to someone ordering food in a restaurant, okay? So let's listen about um, the things that happen. I know that you have your book, so. If you don't have it, we have right here, but remember that you have to start working because on your guy number one, you have to take a picture, a screenshot, and then you have to upgrade to your guy, okay? So it's better that you work with me right now. Okay. Listen, okay? Read and listen to someone ordering food in a restaurant. Are you ready to order? Or do you need some more time? I'm ready, babe. I think I'll start with the potato soup. 
Then I have the roast chicken. What does that come with? It comes with a salad, and there's also a choice of vegetables. Tonight we have carrots or little tomatoes. I'd like the carrots, please. I want chicken salad. Maybe I'll have the tomatoes. Ah, certainly. And anything to drink? I'd like sparkling water, please. No ice. Okay. If a waiter writes in a prison that are in a restaurant and in English and Spanish it's the same thing that you order, then says, what do you want to order? I want to, um, you have the, the menu, right? And you choose the things that you want. And then the waiter tell you if you want it or you don't want it or things like that, okay? So for drink and things like that, someone else, it's a conversation, a normal conversation in a restaurant. The waiter is the man and the waitress is the woman, right? So, part number F. Says here, infer meaning. Check the correct answer according to the photo story. Number one, what does the customer order? And you have to make a check to all the things that the, 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 the woman ordered, okay? If you think that she ordered an appetizer and in okay. a okay. dessert and something to eat, so you check, okay? And the number two says, what does the entry come with? Soap and salad, salad and dessert, carrots and grilled tomatoes, Salad and carrots or boiler tomatoes or water. Okay, so it's easy. I'm going to play again. Please concentrate right here. Okay, I'm going to play again the audio and please check the correct answer in the part number one and in the part number two. Okay, we then listen to someone ordering food in a restaurant. Are you ready to order? Or do you need some more time? I'm ready, thanks. I think I'll start with the potato soup. Then I'll have the roast chicken. What does that come with? It comes with a salad, and there's also a choice of vegetables. Tonight we have carrots or little tomatoes. I'd like the carrots, please. I want chicken salad. Maybe I'll have the tomatoes. Certainly. And anything to drink? I'd like sparkling water, please. No ice. So here I understand, I underline. Says that she ordered potato soup with roast chicken. And says right here that it comes with salad and there is, and there is also a choice from a vegetable. Tonight we have a carrot or grilled tomatoes and customer said that she wants the tomatoes and says something to drink. Says water, please, with not ice. Okay. So now this one we are not going to check it. Okay. You have to work on it, and then remember that you have to take a photo and. It says right there, please work on it, okay? So let's work, okay? Let's change the page. Go to the other page. This page, we are going to work on this page, okay? It says vocabulary categories of food, not a specific food, like for example, ice cream, bananas, eh, potatoes, no. A category of food. A category of food is a group of food that has something that connects each other. For example, if you say, if you are looking right here, meat, oh, sorry, fruit. There are group of of uh, of food that has something that connects each other. The same thing of vegetable, meat, um, seafood, okay, etc. and etc. Okay. So, please use your book on page number four, this one, this part, page number four, okay? 
and let's work all together. There's vocabulary, read and listen, then listen again and repeat. Add another clue to each category, okay? So let's listen right now, okay? Read and listen. Fruit. Apple. Bananas. Grapes. Oranges. Vegetables. Carrots. Peppers. Broccoli. Onions. Meat. Chicken. Lamb. Sausage. Beef. Seafood. Fish. Clam. Shrimp. Crab. Squid. Grains. Pasta. Rice. Noodles. Bread. Dairy products. Butter. Cheese. Milk. Yogurt. Oils. Corn oil. Olive oil. Coconut oil. Sweets. Candy. Pies. Cake. Cookies. Okay. Now listen again and repeat in the pauses. Okay. So. I have the flashcards right here again. Okay. Let's verify the flashcards here. We are doing four. That's the one. Okay. So, listen, okay? Ah, sorry. Fruit. The category of fruit is. Fruit. Fruit, okay? Apples. Apples. Apples, right? It's in plural for that it's apples. What is the name of this one? Bananas. Bananas. Okay. Bananas. Easy, right? And this one? Grapes. 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 And this one? Oranges. Oranges. They are fruits, right? Oranges. Next one. Okay, this one category is uh, R. What is the name of, of this kind of fruit? Vegetables. 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 Right. We have carrots, 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 carrots. carrots. peppers, and chili pepper. Uh, yes, pepper. peppers. The group are pepper, and chili pepper is this one, right? This one is a chili pepper. This one are pepper. And the groups are peppers. Broccoli. 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 Mm -hmm. Onions. 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 Meat. 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 Chicken. 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 Lamb. Lamb. Tomahawk. Huh? Yes. Tomahawk too. It's fun. Tomahawk or lamb. Sausage. Sausage. Salchichas. But in English it's not salchichas, it's sausage. Sausage. Beef. Ham. Ham. Yes, it could be, okay? It's fine. Sea food. Sea food. Shark. Fishes. Fish. Yes. 
fish. Fishes, no. Uh, in English, for example, fish are the group of in plural and singular, we use fish, only fish are simpler, okay? Seafood. Seafood. Fish. 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 A salmoncito. Lamb. And this? Uh, lambs. Clam. Clam. Shrimp. 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 Mm -hmm. Shrimps. Excellent. Shrimps. Crab. 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 And this one? Calamardo. Calamardo. Squid. <laughs> Squid. Squid. Grains. Grains. Uh -huh. Grains. Pasta. 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 Rice. 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 Noodles. 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 Noodles, right. Bread. 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 Dairy products. Dairy products. Butter. 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 Cheese. 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 Milk. 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 Yogurt. 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 This one. Oil. 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 Olive. Olive. Corn oil. Corn. Oil. Corn. Corn. Olive. 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 Chocolate. 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 Candy. Candy. Okay, so I'm going to pass list right now, okay? I am going to pass list and you have to work right now on the part of your A, okay? Then you have to write another thing, different. For example, number one, you have the sample right there that says apples, bananas, grapes, and oranges, and you have mango, right? Then vegetables, the same thing. One vegetable that do not appear right there, the same with meat, seafood, grains, dairy, cabbage, oil, and sweet, okay? Work, and I'm going to pass this right now, okay? Let me see. Where is? Okay, please say it's present, okay? Aragón, are you here? Present. Thank you. Okay, Chitán. Present. Okay. Juque. Present. Eric Castilla. Present. Escobar. Present. Um, Farfán. Present. Gabriel González. Present. Oscar. Present. Saúl. Present. Carlos Kisibi. Present. Sebastián Rodas. Present. Thank you. Manuel Sarratierra. Present. 
Is your birthday today? Uh, no. I did you have something? I think that it was your birthday. Okay, and uh, Ventura, Kevin. Present. Okay. So we are complete. Thank you for staying here. Teacher, ¿puedo poner shark en el seafood? No, because you cannot eat shark. Or do you eat a shark before? Tal vez. Okay, let me see. Let's do vegetables. Let me see. Hey, Eric, what do you write on vegetables? Yes. ¿Cómo? Eh, no escuché. What do you write in vegetables? Uh, in vegetables. Uh -huh. eh, carrots, broccoli, okay. eh, yes, peppers. Yes. No, Eric. You have to write another different. Tomato. Oh. Potatoes. Tomato. Potatoes or potatoes. Yes, Jael. No era para decirle tomato. Ah, okay. Thank you. Okay, let me see. Uh, Jael, can you please tell me your example ¿Qué? in? Ya vio que me puso la difícil mis, no encuentro una para esa. <laughs> Ham. Yes. Ham. In my case, I I write I wrote Turkey. Yo soy un experto gordo, sé todo. Turkey or pork, you can write something like that. Seafood. Any of you want to tell me anything on seafood? Sí, shark. Shark, uh -huh. shark. <laughs> Did you never eat shark? No. Did you eat shark before? Okay. Shark. Okay, I wrote, I wrote lobster. Do you know what is that? The lobster? That are in Spanish. Um, Mojarra. I'm going to show you what is lobster, but let's continue. Grains. Something no. in grains? What do you no. like? Okay. Cereals. Cereals, excellent. Dairy products. Cream. Cream. Cream, yes, cream. Yeah. Oils. Vegetable oil. Oils normal. No, no, okay. Vegetable oil and sweet. Coca-Cola. Soda. Soda. Okay, so the only part that you need to work by yourself is the part number B. That says how many foods can you create? Use the vocabulary. Following the examples, apple juice, mango juice. So you have to mix, okay? All things work. So we finished the class for today, okay? Yeah, with your own. We finished the chair. class. Today. Yes? An English lab?